Hello everyone, this is Adam again. Thank you for stopping by my channel today. I do hope all you had a chipper and blessed day. Today I'm here to do a VR request for the channel, Show Us Your Heads. Great channel, which I will leave the link to down below in the description. Also, you might know this channel by its former name, I'm Yo Tinny. Great guy, been around for a while. Loves to rip packs with his uh, wife and his dad. Uh, check him out, I promise you, you won't regret it. Now on to the request though. The request is to share your hits or show your hits from 2023. He mentioned that you can show hits that you pulled from packs and or purchases or pickups that you made so far in 2023. So on to my cards. So here are a few cards that I picked up via breaks. Of course, you know, I'm a big Braves fan, so I've had some Braves uh, breaks that I've been into. Got a Dansby Swanson uh, from A&G there. Then I got a Von Grissom. Then I got a Matt Olson, three autographs. And I also purchased a mystery pack and uh, was able to pull this beautiful number one of 10, Ichiro. Let's go. So now I'm going to jump to my biggest Chipper Jones pickups so far of uh, 2023. So I picked up quite a bit of Chipper Jones, of course. But here are my one of one Chipper Jones I picked up so far this year. I picked up this uh, 2023 Leaf Metal. This is the magenta printing plate. Then I also picked up the yellow 101 printing plate. And here are the cards from th those printing plates. All 101s, as you can see right there, 101s. I got some kind of red colored version there. Then a, like a cracked ice black. Then a pink or magenta color one. Then a purple wave. Then kind of a little bit of an acetate look on the sides right here. Red. Then kind of like a black or brown cracked ice version. And here's like a brown acetate looking version. Once again, all those were one of ones. Then I got the red wave that was in a slat. But here's my favorite. Chipper Jones pickup so far this year. So this Topps Defensive Collection Chipper Jones inscribed Go Braves. I love that card. And of course, you know, I love my boy Chipper Jones. So those are my Chipper Jones pickups um, or at least my one of one pickups so far this year. Leave that one right there. I do have some other pickups I'm going to share with y'all as well. So I actually love hockey. Been trying to pick up a few more hockey cards for my PC sit there and went ahead and got this Kel McCarr. Well, I think uh, he's undervalued right now in the market. Number the 249 rookie card, the retro exquisite collection version and a PSA 9. Of course, if I didn't mention, it's number the 249. So I love that. Low pop, right? And I got a TB12 rookie card, PSA 10. Then I got a Patrick Mahomes and a PSA 9 on the rated rookie. Then I'm also a big Steph Curry fan, so I try to pick up his stuff when I can. So this is a case hit from a Donruss Optic checkerboard and a PSA 10. Case hit, I love that. Then I picked up two of his rookie cards and a PSA 9. But probably my favorite basketball, or second, should I say second favorite basketball pickup this year has been this beauty right here. This Atomic Refractor of Michael. Jordan and a PSA 9. I love that. Atomic refractors are very hard to pull. And uh, and a PSA 9 quality is even uh, rarer, right? All right. So on to some baseball ones now. So I got this Nolan Ryan patch card, red, white, and blue. I love that patch there on that. And I love the fact that it's numbered to 25. Let's go. Then I also have this Steve Carlton two-color patch with Nolan Ryan on the back, red, white, and blue again, number to 25. Now on to some of my rookie cards that I picked up so far this year. I got a Roger Maris and a PSA 1 rookie card. A Lou Brock and a PSA 3. Ron Santo and a PSA 5. Trying to get a rookie card slabbed. I've had some of these rookie cards or got some of these rookie cards raw. I'm trying to get uh, slab versions of them. 
Got a, a PSA 5 of George Brett on the Topps Mini. And I got a Joe Morgan on a PSA 5. A Gaylord Perry, PSA 5. And then a Jim Cott and a PSA 5. Got an Orlando Cepeda in a PSA 5. A couple of these rookie cards reminds me of this BGS or Beckett Grading Service authentication uh, return I've also gotten here recently. Gotten a few rookie cards, uh, TTM through the mail with uh, Hall of Fame autographs. I'm going to be dropping that video here soon. So if you like uh, Hall of Fame rookie cards with ink on it, you're going to want to check that one out as well. But I do have Mr. Jim Catfish Hunter on his rookie card here as well. Then I got a little bit of a newer player, Derek Jeter, and a PSA 6. I have a, like a 6.5 or a 7.5 or something like that in a GMA version, so I wanted to get one in a, a PSA slab as well. So then I got a Malter and Trammel rookie card on a PSA 7. All right, so that right there would make most of my years uh, pretty epic right there with those cards by themselves. But in my opinion... These next six are going to be my favorite six pickups so far this year. Starting off with this beautiful Jackie Robinson, number 42. Ah, oh, that is so beautiful. Even though it's only authentic, I still cherish and love this card so, so much. Bam. It's only like my third vintage uh, Jackie Robinson that I have. So I'm going to cherish that bad boy all year long. You might see that in another video or two if I get the opportunity. All right, so the next card I have is Miguel Cabrera, the last guy to hit for the Triple Crown, or had the Triple Crown. And this is a PSA 10 rookie card. Let's go. And let's see. This next one is the other basketball card I was talking about a little earlier, Larry Bird and Magic Johnson. This has kind of been on my wish list the last two years. And I was finally blessed and fortunate enough to be able to save up enough money to get one this year. Let's go. Bam. And that was in a PSA 6. So these next, or these last three, are going to be probably one of my favorite players in the game right now. And it is one, Mike Trout. So I got a 2010, which is the prospect year card of Mike Trout. On card autograph and a PSA 8. And these next two are going to be in BGS slabs. Got Mike Trout on a number to 10 on card autograph from 2017 Tops Tribute and a 9.5. And the autograph is a 10. And last but not least, for this episode of showing us or showing everyone the hits for 2023. For Adam's car closet, this is going to be this beautiful Mike Trout right here. I love that. 45 home runs in one season and 9.5 on card, number to 10. So, let me know what was your biggest pool or biggest purchase so far of 2023 down in the comments. And also let me know which of these cards was maybe your favorite card as well. I know it's going to be hard, so maybe pick two or three or four, you know, be all good. I just love to interact with y'all down in the chats and the comments, please. But please take care, stay chipper, and we'll see you in the next video. Oh, yeah, and don't forget to go by, show us your hits, and to show them some love, please. Bye now.